love that you have for one another. It goes back a number of years, I know. Initially as a coach and a student, an eventual first date at a wedding of all places, engaged over the last year or so. Indeed, you have come to know each other very well over the years. And your family and friends, they have delighted in watching that love grow and mature. They delight in seeing how the two of you are so often on the same page and even without having to talk about it, how each of you have the others back. Brian, I'm pretty sure no one would have thought that our first wedding date would lead to this moment, but I'm so thankful that it did. In an unspoken way, we knew it was right from the beginning, and we never looked back. I love the easy joy you bring to life. You make all the small things feel like big things. Your energy and passion for everything you do is contagious. I can't wait to begin this next chapter, and I know our life is going to be incredible and full of adventure. I really am honored to be here today. Thank you so much for letting me be part of this most important day of your lives. I love you both with all my ginger body. We are families and I love you always. I wish you nothing but happiness, joy and non-stop love. Please look after him. Please raise your glasses to the best couple I know, Phoebe and Kayri. Congratulations. Katie is special to us, if you haven't already noticed. She will always be Miss Messy. In my memories, and we're creating new memories today that I will cherish forever. Okay, I'm doing it. Are you guys doing it? Katie, this has been an unforgettable weekend. I'm so lucky to be sharing this memory with you and our family. The amount of love I have for you is indescribable. I couldn't imagine a better soulmate to create a life with. I can't wait to share many more memories with you and one day have a family of our own. Don't sneak up on me. You're, are you sneaking up on me? Oh, you're always beautiful, but you're so gorgeous today. Don't cry, you can't cry. Why me? I can't. That's my job. Brian, I charge the two of you as you stand here in the presence of the living God to remember that love and loyalty alone will avail as the foundation of a happy home. If the vows that you are about to make be kept inviolate, and if you earnestly desire to do the will of God, then your life will be full of joy, and the home that you are establishing will abide in peace. No ties are more tender, no vows are more sacred than the ones you are about to assume. Katie and Brian, you truly do everything to the fullest. Whether it's on the tennis court or in the classroom, or as we all saw yesterday on the pickleball court, I can't wait to see what you guys do as husband and wife. Life is undoubtedly busy for the two of you, but on this day, you pause. You set aside lessons and cross-country meets, and teaching, and we strive throughout this time, this service, to continue to, to put that love on with which God has blessed you.
kiss the bride. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my great pleasure to be the first to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Brian Bailey. It must be love. Well, it must be love. Well, it must be love. Thank <laughs> you. 